Hey there, I'm Chaz Tacular, and welcome to episode 4 of American Arcadia. When last we saw Trevor Hills, he had just snagged himself a sweet ride. Will he be able to escape the dome? Let's see. Going nowhere. We're going nowhere, apparently. Okay, Trevor? How's the car battery? Good, good. Still full. Oh. This is going smooth as silk. At this pace, we'll reach the dome exit in no time. Let's hope so. Mind if I tune to a little music? Not at all. And you're listening to WABC Hits, Arcadian Station with the finest music around the clock. This is DJ Zoom, the cream of the crop, only Stella, out of sight, number one hits, baby. And the music just keeps coming in this hot Friday afternoon. Ah, <sighs> much better. Next is my girl, Meryl Jefferson, with our groovy hit, Don't Be a Fool. Oh, come on, Angela. What? <laughs> I had nothing to do with it this time, I swear. God, what have I done to deserve this torture? The song is everywhere. Enough already. Everybody loves Merle, man. Don't be a fool is a hit. Inside and outside are... Shit, 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 shit! What? I can see five interceptor cars, and they're heading straight to the Arcadia Dome. Wait, you think they're coming after me? It's very likely. Uh, I have to think of something. How does she know they're interceptors? And not just cops. Uh. Hi, bendito. Now what? Oh, this doesn't bode well. Oh crap! It's Kendra. Yes. Hello, Angela. It's Kendra. Can I come up? Um, I'm a little tied up right now, Kendra. I. Don't worry. It won't be long. I'm coming up. Ay, pero qué quiero ahora? What's happening, Angela? <sighs> Kendra's coming up to my apartment, and there's like a ton of incriminating material in here. Hey, who's Kendra? My stupid boss. She's coming up. What do I do? Get rid of any compromising material, Angela. I'll help you think from here. Okay, These well, breakout that pamphlets won't look good if Kendra finds them. Uh... Wait, you showed me things. Info about Gus and all that. You don't have that lying around your house, do you? I do. I do. I do. I'll be up to my ass in trouble if Kendra sees this breakout dossier. Yeah, okay, okay. Any forbidden corporate things? Like, I don't know, anti-Arcadia uh, yeah, that's no problem. Angela? Am I sure that the Tango uh, Pizza's no yeah, problem? No okay, problem. okay, okay, the Tango Pizza's no problem. What about my Panic! Plan? Do you have it written down somewhere visible? Oh crap, it's all over everything! Get rid of it! Gah! Angela! Come on, come on, go faster! She is at the gates as we speak! Okay, that's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Let's get rid of all this crap. What is that? What is that? Close that. Ah! Ah! I can hear you in there, Angela. Go faster! Angela, open the door. I'm 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 naked. Don't don't come in. Open it now. Door lock override. Door lock override. Hey, Kendra, how'd you get in here? Well, all supervisors hey. have access to their Shit, employees' apartments, just, just in case. Why yeah, didn't really. you open the door? I thought something happened to you. Uh, no I reason. was going to, but you were faster. Do you mind if I take a look around? Yeah. Around my apartment? Yeah, it'll just be a second. Uh, okay, I guess. Suit yourself. Hey, what's that in the window? Uh, nothing. I don't. What, what's what in the window? What? Oh gosh, what are those? I have no idea how those got there. Huh. Leaving all the evidence in plain sight. Clever. You're fired. Okay. Wait, crap. You okay. Me crap, 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 crap. Info okay. Gus and all that? I have to work fast. Go. Get it all. Get every Angela, bit of it. Doesn't a computer always take an eternity? Shut down. I'd do that first if I were you. Oh gosh. Alright. Yep, yep, come on, shutting come on, down. Come on, shut down already. Why are these so slow? Can I go faster? You talked about that group you work for. Angela. Breakout. Is there something in your house that would link you to them? These are so slow. There's no way I can do this. In time. Like maybe there are certain cards I can leave I can up. Hear you in there, Angela. Okay, there might be certain ones I can leave up. Uh, definitely oh, get that one. That's get not good. Can't you just cover it all up somehow? 
Oh, you clever son of a gun. Oh. Hey, Kendra, how oh. did you get in here? Well, hey. all supervisors have access to their employees' apartments, just in case. But I have nothing to hide. At all. Nothing whatsoever. Yep. Where'd the cat go? Where's that cat? Well, your apartment isn't as cluttered as your office. It still has your personal touch for chaos, though. Thank you, I think. You look nervous, Angela. Is everything okay? No, uh, I'm no, fine. No, apart from my supervisor breaking into my apartment, uh, everything's hunky-dory. I'm a little concerned about the cat, this though. This board has been erased recently. Oh, yeah, that's why they're called dry erase boards. Because you can, you know, erase them? Hmm. So far, so good. Well, 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 what do we have here? You're interested in the Arcadia 6, huh? I gotcha. Oh gosh, are we gonna grab this? We're gonna grab that, we're gonna close that, we're gonna turn that off, we're gonna grab that off the wall. I'm gonna get rid of all of this. Okay, that's clean. Anything else I'm missing? Yeah, that's Any good. Forbidden corporate things like I don't know, uh, anti-arcadia propaganda. Yeah, no, no, no. Oh, crap, crap, crap. Close that drawer. Yes, okay. Um I can hear you in there, Angela. Up here? Okay, there's the cat. Uh th that's no problem. Yeah, okay. Cool. The cat is asleep. Door lock override. Opening door. Angela. Hey, oh. Kendra! Oh, hey! How'd you get in here? Well, all supervisors have access to their employees' apartments. Okay, I think I got everything this time. She's looking at the litter box. Well, your apartment isn't as cluttered as your office. You look nervous, Angela. Is everything okay? Uh, no, apart from my supervisor breaking into my apartment, uh, everything's hunky-dory. This board has been erased recently. Oh, yeah, that's why they're called dry erase boards. Because you can, you know, erase them? Hmm. Okay. Are you worried? You don't have anything to hide, do you? Oh, aren't we a little paranoid, Kendra? Well, I would certainly hope so. Your blinds are lowered. Yeah, sunset light bothers me. Nothing close. unusual here. Is there anything wrong with your computer? Why is it off? We're in lockdown. Why do you want me to turn the computer on to beat my Minesweeper high score? Hmm. Is that it? Are you done? Angela, please come here. Uh -huh. Kendra, what is this all about? Let's lay our cards on the table. We're friends, right? Um, we are? If you were doing anything to harm Walton Media's reputation, I would be deemed directly responsible, and you wouldn't want that. So tell me, how is it possible that you had admin permissions today? Oh, I did? Uh, that's news to me. Uh, maybe poor Gene got it wrong. He's been under so much stress lately. But you could check the surveillance cameras if you doubt me. I didn't even go near the server room today. Huh. I have one more question, Angela. Answer it and be honest. Are you the one helping Trevor Hills escape Arcadia? No, I am not. Have a nice evening, Kendra. Door locked. Fuera de mi casa. Ooh. Sounds like everything went sort of okay, huh? <laughs> sort of. I owe you one, man. Wait, you owe me? Come on, Angela. No, really. Thank you, Trevor. 
You're a good guy. Okay, well, I am going back to my computer now. Turn that back on. How's, uh, how's everything going on your side? It turned good, on good. really fast. I think I'm reaching the suburb area. When you see the Adam Arena Stadium oh. on your left, drive past it and take the next exit to the suburbs. Hey, Angela, I was wondering, how is it possible for the Arcadia Adams to play against teams from the outside? Oh, all players are NPCs, non-protagonist characters. That makes People sense. People who live inside Arcadia but are part of the show, uh, like Vivian. Next topic, connection with Arcadia-born citizens. Now, you've been given some plot points by the story team, but engagement is critical in here, specifically with the ones in your assigned network. Ordinary lives are not interesting by themselves. We gotta make sure that things happen. That's good for the audience, for your assigned citizens, and in the end, for you too. That's what you, what we are in here for. To be their shitty bosses, their rivals, or BFFs. It all depends. And, who knows, maybe even their spouses. <laughs> it's not common, but it has happened. I mean, I consider myself as the first NPC in Arcadia. Well, not actually the first one. I'm not that old. <laughs> but the thing is, the story team would never ask you to do anything that I wouldn't do myself. Hmm. So if you ever wondered why everything goes well for the absolute jerks, egomaniacs, and obnoxious people in the city, now you know why. Well, that explains some things. Yeah. I bet that Romano, my supervisor, was one of those. Could be. I don't know. I only have access to my assigned citizen grid. But, you know, George Bernstein, your neighbor, he was in cahoots with the show from day one. Not Mr. Bernstein. That Bernstein I bear. No, no, no. There's no need, really. You revealed quite enough of Arcadia's intricate lies for me today. Hey, Angela. I'm beginning to hear that noise again. It's still distant, but... All right, all right. Uh, keep driving until you can't drive anymore. This is horrible. It's hard to describe how it sounds. Oh, help. I, I can't. I, you have to. You have to do it. That was a sudden I'll, I'll stop. Now, Trevor. Don't worry. Oh, I have to do it in CCTV mode. Look at that. Those things that look like comm towers. I, I think I saw some at the checkpoint too. Oh. Yeah, you're definitely right. Must be transmitters or something. It's even louder than it was at the checkpoint. I can hear it even if I cover my ears. Trevor, uh. we uh, okay. Now we have to cross that area. Do not touch the steering wheel or the brakes, please. As if I could. It's hard for me to even blink. Oh, damn it! Oh, God! They're tearing my brain apart! Hold on, hold on just a little longer, Trevor. This does not sound good. Ah! Come on, Trevor. There. We're almost there. You can do it. How do you feel now? Like... I had the biggest damn magnet inside my head, and someone was pulling on it. Oof. But I'm better. I, I feel better. Good. You think you could drive now? Yeah. Yeah, I think so. Good. Good. Okay. Let's get the hell out of here once and for all. Yeah, that was like zero to sixty in like Finally. point five seconds. You're don't say it, don't say it, Angela. Last time you jinxed it. Yeesh, okay. But you're out of the transmitter zone, so what could go wrong now? I've been involved in high speed pursuit for years. I'm not scared of it. Oh my. I study the road layout, carefully cover all the exits, register everything in a 10 mile radius, and calculate every possibility. I can't afford myself to fail. Not while I'm on duty. Oh boy. Stop the car immediately or face the consequences. Son of a. The interceptors are here. Knew it. Jesus, I knew it! Trevor, step on the gas. These guys are crazy. They're gonna kill me! We're really close, Trevor. Just a few miles ahead. 
We, we didn't see that crashing. Yeah, there's a lot you didn't see. Doesn't mean it didn't happen. See these wounds? Let's say I was lucky to survive a crash at 95 miles per hour. I don't see the wounds. And that was only the first car crash of the weekend. The first? <sighs> what? Ow! Oh, Jesus. Ah. Angela, where am I? Angela? Angela! Are you there? I can't hear- oh, Damn it, I lost my earpiece. Oh no. Oh I to, boy. I have to get out of here. Move, Trevor. Come on, move! Well, this explains the opening scene of the game. How far away is the edge of the dome from here? That's what you think. I am not in that car anymore. I must be really close I'm to the my dome way exit. out. I have to get out. Yeah, come on, Trevor. You can do this. You can do this. Just gotta keep putting one foot in front of the other, and also avoid being seen, and also like run like hell when the time comes. I don't know if I can make it across. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try. Trevor's not a pathetic wimp. I mean, sure, he's he's not Steve Just, but my back. I almost broke my back. Oof. Come on, Trevor. Come on, you gotta keep going. Yeah, come on, man. This is literally life or death. You gotta keep putting one foot in front of the other. There we go. Oh, jeez. Oh, man, I'm covered in mud. Hey, you know what? People get dirty. Starting search on new coordinates. Go the other way. Go the other way. Uh huh. Yep. Okay. I don't think he heard us. All right. What is? Okay. Oh, crap. And go. Yeah, this reminds me a lot of the first mission of Inside. Don't mix it's 31 to 35. This is right ahead. Okay. I'm going in the right direction. Sweet. Let's get to that dome exit. 10392. Can you hear me? Nope. Surrender now, and this will be over. I don't hear you. I think the foot chase has to start any time now. Nope, oh, nope, 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 no, sir. Nope. Nope, keep pulling it back, keep pulling it back. Now move on. Okay, there you go, there you go. Okay. Going under the overpass. You're sending a damn helicopter to catch me? Really? Yeah, I mean you're you're like enemy number one right now. Oh gosh. This is familiar. Yeah? You'll have to catch me first, you jerk! Come on, Subject Trevor. Administering this guy's shooting at me! Target missed. Subject still in cover. 
So they are bad shots. Please just leave me alone. Oh, come on. Okay, let's do this. I can't believe it. these guys are shooting at me. So obviously I have to hide. Yep, okay, there we go. Get over this. Just leave me alone. What? Just an account, man. Where am I supposed to hide from the second pass? I can't believe it. These guys are shooting at me. From the third pass, I guess. Okay. So I can hide there. Oh, and then I hide here. And then I hide here. And then I push this over. Come on. Keep going, keep going! No! What? 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 I can't believe it. These guys are shooting at me! Come on. Okay, now now what do I do from here? Can I jump up? No. I can't Where where do I go from there? There's nowhere to go! I can't jump up! I can't believe it. These guys what in the world? are shooting at me! There's no way I can get back to this spot in time. Moving to the opposite side. Okay, let's push that over. And then run like our lives depend on it, because they do. I can't believe it. These guys are shooting at me! Yeah, where where do I go after I knock that over? If there's nowhere to jump. I mean, if I could get over behind that box, but it won't let me do that. There's nowhere to go! What do I do here? What in the world? I can't believe it. These guys are shooting at me. No hit. I repeat, no hit. I'm just an account manager. Uh, can I get in the... In the... Whoa, whoa, whoa. What was that? What was that? Is there like a window I couldn't see? Okay, can I pull it? No, I can't pull it. Go, 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 go! Okay. So I cannot pull the thing, I have to push it over. But by the time I push it over, I can't go anywhere. This is ridiculous. What am I supposed to do here? I can push that over, and then I can run. Come on! Cause I can't, I can't jump up. I can't. Are you kidding me? Well, I don't know if I want to actually leave this in or not. I just looked up a walkthrough because I was not getting anywhere, doing the same thing over and over again. Because apparently I'm insane. So let's do this again. Wow. We can drag this stupid thing. Ha Guess I should have realized it was movable. Yeah. Okay, let's get the heck out of here. No hit. I repeat, no Come on, hit. Trevor, you can do this. Keep going, keep going. Huh. 
Okay. I just lowered the water level, I guess. Okay. Let's run like the wind. Don't you have anything better to do than chase me, you idiots? Nope, nope, nope. nope. Okay, then I'm gonna hide here. Wait for him to do another sweep. Go up here. Come on. Come on, sweep by me. Sweep by me. No hit. I repeat, no hit. Gonna get behind this. And then it's just a nice slide down the incline. Oh so gosh. Wait. What? What? Okay, so I think I have to jump at the bottom of the thing. Like into that pipe, probably. Ah! Jump! Ah! Woo! Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo! Is not down. That was that was very amazing. Good job, Trevor. Keep going, Trevor. You can do this. Don't say. Executing turning maneuver to intercept target. Uh oh. No, no. Damn it. No. Okay, let's maybe not skip over the broken board. This time. The water treatment station is a restricted area. Stop immediately. Oh. What? Come on. Okay, so let's let's run over the board and then run back. Well, okay, so I gotta jump on it, run run away, and then run back when when it switches. My brain has not worked. Jump. There we go. And wait for it. Wait for it. Go the other way. Come on. Come on. And... Nope. What? So we jump once, twice. Turn around. And jump again. There we go. Water treatment station four. Oh my god, that was close. Now, okay. Where am I? That is an excellent question. Uh, you are in water treatment station number four, actually. That is your current location. Oh come on, how do I get to? The... Oh, yeah. I have to get there. Okay. Somehow. Yep. Uh, what does this button do? Okay, looks like a hydro elevator. Okay, and if I hit it again, uh huh. Okay. Yeah, I'll just move this onto this elevator pad thing, and then we'll uh, bring it down to this level. Okay, just move it over to the other side, bump it on up, and we should be good. Okay. Can I, can I get up there? There, there we go. Alright, there we go. Good. Now I can move this thing to reach the other side of this damn station. Right. So how do people even find their way around here? Although I doubt this spot of Arcadia attracts many visitors. Yeah. 
Not even sure if a human is supposed to be in this exact spot. Oh, nope, nope. Okay, so how do I get over to that pipe? There we go. All right. See, this isn't too bad, Trevor. This isn't too bad. Uh, the dome exit must be ahead. Okay. Yeah, how can I tell when I get to the edge of the dome? Huh, okay. So how do I get that knocked over? Um... Okay. Huh. There's a scissor lift in here. I could really use Angela's ability to control and or manipulate devices right now. Yeah. Can I move it? I can move it. Yeah, that should work. Okay. Then I'll drop down here. Go back to the beginning. Yeah. Yeah! This should work. Okay. So I wonder if this place is just always abandoned? Uh oh. So I wonder if this place is just always abandoned or if NPCs actually work out here. Because this is past the, the sound barrier, the, the jingle barrier. Okay, what, what am I... What? Okay, let's try pushing this thing. That doesn't do it. Um... That apparently was not the right move at all. Okay, let's just introduce ourselves. Let's be friendly. Hi. Oh, no. I'm Trevor. Apparently, you don't like me. Okay, um... Can I get back over this way? No, I cannot. So what am I supposed to do here? I can't push the, the box. If I jump on that, I fail. Okay, let's try this. One, two. Eye on the target. No, oh, no. Surrender now. No! That worked. There we go. All right. Let's keep the truck and keep moving right. We are going the right way. <laughs> ah! No, 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 I'm oh, yeah. so close. No, no, I'm so close. Come on, Trevor. So once I get out of Arcadia, I'm still going to be in like a Walton housing area. Yes, yes, yes. I'm almost there. Oh wow, that's close. I made it, I finally made it. So I'm still gonna have to avoid the cops and stuff. Or at least the Walton enforcers. Oh, my God. oh wow. That must be the edge of the Arcadia Dome. Come on, Trevor. There's the exit. Something bad is about to happen. I can feel it. No, no, no! There's no way out. Oh, what do I do now? There's a retractable bridge down there. If only Angela were here. Damn it! Okay, uh. It's over, 10392. Don't do anything stupid. Just raise your hands and surrender. <sighs> I mean, you're gonna kill me anyway. Okay. I, I give up. I've been dealing with dangerous individuals for my entire career. So my measures, extreme or not, 
I'm not up for discussion. That's the way I work, period. If you are looking for a little tender, loving care, hire a babysitter. But if you want to make sure that nobody leaves this city, I am your man. Hit him. What? Hey, no! I just saw it! We got 10392. We're bringing him to the core. We all know and enjoy Arcadia's splendid temperature, thanks to its weather-controlled dome. But how does the dome get enough energy to generate this endless spring and its 43 square miles throughout the whole year? Well, that's exactly the function of the core power plant. In this station built inside the dome, 100% renewable and safe energy is extracted daily to supply the entire city with electricity, hot water, and other necessary resources. The core is the beating heart of the city of tomorrow. And to handle a beating heart, a thinking brain is required. And that is what the hexagon is for. A high-tech security building outside the Arcadia Dome, where every system that keeps the city functioning is carefully operated by technicians and engineers. The dome, the core, and the hexagon. The lungs, heart, and brain of Arcadia. So are they taking me out of the dome? Four hours after the car crash. So the core was outside of the dome? Why didn't they just euthanize him? Ten three ninety two. Oh look. If it isn't the Arcadia Gestapo, what do you want with me now? With you? Nothing. What I need to know is the name of your cooperator on the outside. So spit it out. Who is helping you? Nobody. I just went for a short stroll, but I got lost on the path of life. Oh, you think this is funny? You think I'm afraid to use more extreme measures with you? Chief, that's enough. That's no way to treat a person. He's not a person. He's property, but your property in any case, Miss Walton. All yours. Wow. I'll be watching you, 10-392. Hey, you're a poet and you didn't even know it. Jerk. Trevor, first of all, I want to apologize for everything that's happened so far. This has been nothing but a terrible misunderstanding. I completely understand your position and I, I'm deeply sorry we should have managed things differently oh, you mean just like acting. when you said that I could be a threat to myself and other citizens and you were look at the sorry state you're in I was just trying to keep you from hurting yourself more yeah sure a likely story Trevor what do you know about Arcadia I know that my whole life here is a lie. I know that Arcadia is nothing but a TV show, and I know that you kill people in here. Sadly, I can't argue with your first two statements, but... Trevor, nobody has been killed in here. What about Tell outside of here? Gus. Hexagon, would you please show Augustus Rainey's house cam on the monitor in room 33? There he is. Gus has been living there for a couple of days now. What on earth? Hello, Gus. Everything all right? Oh, hi, Vivian. Yeah, sure. Everything is just peachy here. Trevor's here with me. Would you say hello to him, please? What? Trevor, my man. Hi, Gus. You're next in line? A TV show, man. Who would have thought, huh? Hey, Gus, Trevor is in a little bit of shock, and I still have to explain the full process to him. We'll talk to you later, okay? Oh, sure, sure. Bye, Vivian. Trevor! See you soon, man. But, but I, I, I saw the images. I, I saw Gus. What did you see exactly besides Gus leaving with two security guards? Come with me, please. 
I want to show you something. The core, the beating heart of the city of tomorrow. So everything I know is a lie? Question mark? I'll be honest. AA ratings are slowly declining. It's not serious yet, but we need to reduce costs. All Arcadia-born citizens require stage technicians, supervisors, camera tracking 24-7. In short, lots of money. Uh -huh. And unpopular citizens, like you or Gus, are just not profitable. So we just need to retire you guys from the show, but not the kind of retirement you're thinking of. You see, the Arcadia Edge isn't actually a travel ground, but rather a relocation program. Edge is our brand new housing community at the edge of the Arcadia Dome. Gus is living there now. But of course, we huh. needed the travel grant thing so we could remove a few citizens without everybody in Arcadia beginning to ask questions. That's where we were going to take you, after giving you a nice compensation package for all the inconvenience. Okay. But no, nobody told me that! You ran away when we were going to explain everything to you. I was just... they told me I had to escape! Ah, uh, of course. They. Yeah, this is blowing Listen, my mind. Trevor, the Arcadia Dome is a major infrastructure under 24-7 surveillance, heavily guarded with multiple security measures. And only I can turn them down. So, the only way to escape from Arcadia is by pressing a fail-safe button in my penthouse at the top of the Arcadia Spire that only I have access to. No matter what they have told you, that isn't happening, Trevor. Well, thank you for telling me the way out. I'm sure that'll come in handy so, later. I'm trapped in here. No, 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 this is not a prison. We can't keep you here against your will. That's literally but what you, you just, just told said me. That I can't get out. No, no, I said you can't escape. Of course you can get out. How am I with those noises? I, I can barely move when I hear those things. Oh, you mean the realignment jingle. Yes, that is one of the security measures I mentioned. You've been conditioned to recognize an acoustic pattern to uh, provide you with an extreme sensation of well-being and comfort. You brainwashed me! Absolutely not! You were born with it, like any other Arcadian citizen in the last 30 years. And you've been hearing it throughout your whole life. What on earth? Oh... Interesting. So, anyway, long story short, we can remove the jingle from you. We'll just take you to a realignment booth and you'll be free of it in a matter of seconds. A realignment booth? I don't like the sound of that. But first, we need you to comply with a few things. By signing this agreement here, you refused. Wait, 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 wait. You. Really think that I'm going to trust you blindly after everything you've done to me? You just told me that I've been a damn Pavlov's dog my whole life, and you expect me to let you guys scramble my brains again? No, wait, screw that! I know this is not an easy decision, Trevor, but I have not told you a single lie. They, on the other hand, cannot say the same thing. Take your time, okay? Whenever you're ready. Look, huh. I know you can hear me. I'm not even going to read this piece of crap. Forget about it. I'm not doing it. You hear me? This is very interesting. Let me out of here. Let me out. I'm not so, signing this. No way. Man, I don't even know the questions to ask. Hey, is anybody there? Yeah, so they're just really letting me let stew. Me in here? You can't keep me in here forever. Well, I can. I mean, the chief of security Specific literally called you property. To not discuss the show interference. I don't know 
how much time I spent locked up in there. Probably wasn't more than a couple of hours, but it felt like an eternity. I know how I that feels. Physically and mentally exhausted from the escape. I had wounds all over my body, and I was still absorbing the harsh truth about my life. So everything came crashing down on me at that moment. I was determined to sign and get it over with. Hmm. Like, can I... Can I actually read it? These guys are crazy! They're gonna kill me! Okay. Okay, now we get to see Angela's side of the equation. Two hours after the car crash. It's been almost two hours and I still don't know where Trevor is. Okay. So... This is not the right time for this. Right, what do I do? What do I do? Walk me through this, Angela. What do I do? Do I just leave? Can I leave? No, I cannot leave. Can I turn the computer? I've been switching through the closed circuit television and I can't find him anywhere. Okay. How about my phone? I don't have time for this now. No, I want the phone. The phone? Aha! Oh shit, my phone! Incoming call. Number six, finally! What happened with Trevor? Where is he? They, they, they pushed him off the road. They. Turn on the TV. What are you talking about? We need to get to. Trust me, Kovacs. Turn the TV on. Oh. Okay. <gasps> He's alive. <laughs> He's alive. Oh, thank God. Uh, who leaked this? Was it us? Of course it was us, Kovacs. They wanted Trevor to be known. Fine. Now everybody knows him inside and outside Arcadia. But where is he now? If he's still inside Arcadia, there must be a way to find him. Maybe, but we would need to access the hexagon. I can sneak inside. Uh, maybe I can track Trevor from there and then go Do to- Do not even think about it, Kovax. The Hexagon is not like any other Walton Media building. We are talking about the nerve center of Arcadia. We are talking about insane security measures. We are talking about- I'm gonna do it. With or without your help, number six. <sighs> okay, fine. But I will be with you, guiding you through the entire process. Copy? Copy that. And if something goes wrong, remember. You do not know us. You have never heard of us. Spare me the lecture. I knew what I signed up for when I joined Breakout. So, right. yeah. Going to the Hexagon was my idea. Well, kind of. And even today, I still wonder if that was a bold move or a stupid move. Probably a bit of both, all things considered. This Four hours is after the car crash. I'm freezing out here. Do you read me, Kovacs? Uh, with a little bit of static due to my old headphones, but I can hear you. Good. Now, listen carefully. Yeah. You are in front of one of the back entrances to the hexagon. The staff here use a special secure digital card to access the place. You will find one in the back alley inside a metallic box. Okay. 20% off with stuffed crust. I I need some of that in my belly right now. Okay. Yeah, there's the back entrance. So I'm looking for a metallic box. So if I was a metallic box, where would I be hiding? That looks metallic. Hey, it's uh, the Arcadia Six sign with oh. all your names written on it. Emily, Dolores, Luther, Sid, uh, Chloe, or Co Cole, and An Antoine. C H O L E. Chol Chol. I don't know. I've never seen that name before. Aha! How did you manage to get your hands on this card? 
That was a combination of social engineering, months of decrypting code, and a bit of pure luck. We were saving it for a special occasion, but what better day than today? Well, I'm about to get into the hexagon. I hope they don't kill me. So far, so good. There okay, are Angela. different levels of access here at the hexagon, all named for geometric shapes. Your SD card grants you access to only the basic level, the triangle. You will not get too far with just that. So, how am I going to find Trevor's location then? We have added some extras to your SD card. One of them is some homebrew software that can be used to reverse engineer level access devices. Okay. So. Okay, so this is the hexagon, the thinking brain of the city of tomorrow, and the core, the breathing heart of the city of tomorrow. So Trevor is at the core? Okay. Okay, so I do have triangle access. Oh wow, I'm like in. Okay. S O A R. Soar? Soar. Like in Walton's motto, soar higher than ever before. Yeah, it's an acronym of the four different areas of this building security, operations, Arcadia control grid, and realignment, whatever that is. Anyway, we should focus on finding Trevor for now. The Arcadia control grid sounds like the place to geolocate him. Yeah, you're right. So is he in realignment right now? Or being moved that way? Okay, okay, let's... Huh. <sighs> Looks like the whole building's empty. You said they were running oh. American Arcadia with a supervisor-only skeleton crew, right? That's good for us. That's good. Apparently the Arcadia control grid is right there. And there's just a hallway, no door. Do not go in there yet, Kovacs. It cannot be that easy. Okay, I'll trust you then. Guess, uh, let's see what's up this door. Or what's through this door. Up here and through this door. English is hard. My access level isn't high enough to get in here. Okay, so apparently I'm not diamond level. Oh, I can sprint! I, I vaguely remember that from before, actually. Okay. Place is still empty, that's good, that's good. I see a machine on the other side of this glass. I believe it has a rhombus symbol on it. Must be an access level device. Make rhombus? Make sure you get there. Copy. That's obviously a diamond. What are, what are you calling a rhombus for? Wait, why can't uh, I move? My phone is vibrating. Remember I can't I move. Remember those extras we added to your SD card? That is a proximity sensor detector. This tool works like a... like a Geiger counter. Whenever you are close to a proximity sensor, that bar will rise. So tread lightly. And if you see that red bar rising, you had better move back. Okay. So... Going that way is not the ticket. Okay, cool, cool. I will go this way. Yep. Don't mind me. Okay, so that's a rhombus. Which means I can't get through I yet. I can't do it. Which means that door is the door I'm gonna have to try to get through if I can. No! I just want through! Looks like I'm gonna have to avoid the proximity sensor like it's a minefield. Okay, let's do this. So I gotta get in there somehow. It looks like there's a door over there. Okay, I'm gonna hug this wall and see, see if that does it. Oh! 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 You're not gonna get me today, Mr. Proximity Sensor! No, sir! Oh! Oh! Okay! 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 I'm... Yep! Yep! Ooh! Nope! Oh! 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 No! Okay! Okay! Let's... Not... Go that way at all. Okay, it seems to be... Like a line across there, so I'm gonna go around this way. 
Ooh, there's a vent. And it just happens to be conveniently open for me. Aha. Uh -huh. Yep, okay. Oh, damn it. Do I really have to yes, get inside that you do. vent? Looks like it. Trevor's been doing all sorts of hard but stuff today. You can I handle this. I can't look this. at my phone in here. How the hell am I going to avoid those sensors? Try to guide yourself with the sound, Kovacs. I bet if I go straight, it's going to... Yep, nope. Cool. Why would they have proximity sensors in the vents? I mean, granted, given everything I know of, like, gaming and pop culture, I probably would too, but... Okay. Let's try to get the going this way, maybe. Nope. Nope. Go this way. And there we go. I don't see any cameras in here. Weird. And you will not see them. Our intel says they do not have cameras in the hexagon. We do not know the reason for this. One comes to mind. Whatever they're doing in here, Walton Media does not want it on record in any way. I hadn't thought of that. Uh, could be. It doesn't sound good. Hmm. What is this? Can't be that easy. Easy now, Kovacs. Dot the I's and cross the T's. Uh-huh. Yep, yep, yep. Uh-huh. That, that door has a timer? Oh, I can't believe it. I gotta go back. Oh, what gosh. kind of moron puts a timer on an automatic door? Well, Kovacs, every automatic door has a timer. <laughs> so we hit it, over to the side, and forward, over to the side, and through the door. Ah, finally, I'm inside. Sweet. Okay, so I want the, the rhombus doohickey. Now you'll have to manually transfer the permission info from the machine to your phone. Sounds easy, but how do I do that? You have to press buttons to swap the positions of the two geometric shapes. It is not that difficult. Okay. And what? Oh! Is that it? Guess there's one way to find out. Access denied. That's not it. Cool. Okay. Okay, so I can do that. How do I... Okay, reset. It, it's green. Can I... is that... Do I have to get rid of that? I don't even know what I'm doing. No, okay, okay, wait, wait. So I do have to get the triangle to this spot. But how do I do that? Um, uh, what am I doing wrong? Oh! Hello. Okay, so I can do that. And... No. I can do that. Hold up. Uh, I'm not nervous. You're nervous. Damn it, what, what, what the... Access level upgraded. New level, wrong. Vivian oh. Walton surprised everyone a few hours ago with this live statement. Following the leak of images of one of its citizens fleeing the show. Uh, oh, I have to admit, I'm enjoying doing my bit to wipe that creepy smile off her face. 
In light of the dissemination of the unauthorized images of the citizen of Arcadia, Trevor Hills, Walton Media feels compelled to issue this statement. We categorically deny all information that has been made public about the circumstances surrounding Trevor Hill's so-called escape. Such information, which is clearly intended to damage Walton Media's good reputation, lacks the slightest hint of veracity. Walton Media and the American Arcadia team have taken every measure to ensure Mr. Hill's physical well-being. Tomorrow at 8 p.m., there will be an official live appearance clarifying everything that happened regarding the behavior of our citizen. This appearance will include the testimony of Trevor Hills himself. Thank you. Wait, Trevor Hills himself? W what is she planning, to wipe his brain clean? You can expect anything from Vivian. I detest her, but I have to admit that wretched woman is shrewd and cunning like no other. Hold on a second. Number six? What's happening? Damn it, guys, they're down here. We need to go, now! Kovacs, they found us. What? Who? All the media's goons, of course. They must be tracking us somehow. Uh -oh. Everybody gear up because we are out in five! Listen, we have to go now. I will get in touch with you again as soon as we reach a safe spot. Okay, okay. Kovacs, find Trevor and get him out. Guys, make sure we leave no trail behind us. From now on, you are on your own. We are counting on you. Stay safe, number six, and good luck. Good luck to you too, Kovacs. Well, frick. That's not good. Alright, so I think there was a rhombus on the door uh, up here. Yep. Okay, wait, I want to look at the map again. Okay, so that was security that I was just in? Okay, yeah, so I was just in security. Oh, it says it over the door. So that's operations. So now I need to go to operations. Um, maybe get another level of access and then go to the control grid. Cool. All right. And I am into operations. Okay, so what are you gonna call this? It's no use. See, that's a pentagon, right? Math was never my strong suit, if you couldn't tell. I'll be damned. I'm on my own. I'm literally scared shitless. Okay, uh -huh. not literally. Okay, well that's a, uh, hold up, one, two, three, four, five, six. Well, a hexagon is eight, right? Or no, is that is a hexagon six? I have to raise my access level to enter this door. Uh huh. Okay, so we've got a hexagon here and a pentagon over there. Looks like I have to go through the vent again. Crawling through the vents. Crawling through the vents. Look at me, I'm crawling through the vents. That's a little bit of a drop. Okay. Oh, looks like I got inside the Walton Media Illuminati meeting. And look Ooh. who's here. Hello, my fellow American Arcadia teammates. It is so good to see all of you here. Hello, Hi, Vivian. Hello, Vivian. First of all, we know that whatever happens tomorrow is going to be crucial to the future of Walton Media and American Arcadia. So, my thanks and appreciation up. to every single Kendra. one of you for your commitment. No, thank you, Vivian. Pathetic. You're too kind, Kendra. I don't deserve you. On a different note, I've talked with Trevor and I'm convinced he'll come to his senses. Sooner than later, I hope. And once he signs, we'll bring him to a realignment booth, and everything will be ready. Realignment booth? Until then, let's stay in high spirits with a positive attitude, and everything will go smoothly. Am I right or am I right? Of course, Vivian! See you tomorrow, then. And remember, teamwork makes the dream work. See you tomorrow! See ya. Bye. Bye. See you tomorrow. Bye, Vivian. Boy, Vivian's super nice. She's the best. Wait till you see the look on Michael's face when I tell him I spoke directly to her. 
Kendra's about as brainwashed as they're Damn about it. to make Trevor. Number six was right. I don't know what a realignment booth is, but it reeks of brainwashing. Yep. Ugh. Vivian really is the evil bitch supreme. I better hurry and find that access machine thingy before Trevor signs anything. Okay. Ooh. Okay, nobody's the in here. Device is right there. Good. Hey, this device works differently. So, what do I need to do now? Okay, so first steps: three, five, six, four ellipses. Okay. Okay, so three. Five, then six, four. Okay. Three, no. Five, two, no. Um, uh, what am I doing wrong? Okay. can't what okay they, let's reset it so three five damn it what, what the? six four three five six four I'm not good at math can I do two no three yeah okay no! Two. Yes. Okay. Oh gosh, okay. Jump that over. Move that, I guess. But if I get those next to each other, then I can't move that out. And if I move that out, then I can't move that in. So what am I supposed to do here? Messed it up. Messed it up. Damn it. What, what the? No, nope, you're, you're, you're good. You're good. There we go. Access level upgraded. Boom. New level. Pentagon. Okay, Pentagon. Okay. Interceptors. I'm telling you, he might look like he's 80, but this guy runs as if his life depended on it. Well, that kind of makes sense. All night long, playing hide and seek in the wetlands. Dan broke a leg chasing that asshole. Really? Man, that's bad. <laughs> no, that's not funny, man. Not a bit. I mean, I thought it was funny. Kovacs, do you copy? Number six, what happened? Did you make it to the safe house? Take the next exit right, number four. Not yet, we're still on the road, but I think we lost them. For now. Any news from Trevor? Yeah, but not good news. You're right. About everything. We have to hurry. We must anticipate and maybe... Maybe carry out a really bold move. What do you mean by that? There is no time now. 
Focus on entering the Arcadia control grid, Kovacs. Well, that's a job a drop. Boop. Okay, the Arcadia control grid. Let's do this. Attention, all security personnel. There has been a security breach in the hexagon. Aha, so we're not going that way yet. Oh, hey, hello. There's a pentagon door right, right here. Okay. That hall is plagued with infrared beams. Not good. Uh -huh. Do you see a way to shut them down? Uh, there is a device in here. Let me try. There are also a lot of cameras in here. Well, two to be precise. Ooh, a mug. Huh. And I thought a Steve Just mug was the worst idea ever. Oh, hexagonal pens for hexagon workers. Wow, such a clever idea. And they don't look uncomfortable to use at all. Okay. So, I think this machine... I don't have oh, access. You gotta be kidding me! The device to shut the beams down is an hexagon level? What do I do? We cannot wait anymore, Kovacs. Memorize the position of the beams and try to... Reenact the laser scene from Ocean's 12. You were gonna say that, right? Uh, sort of. But without the pop culture reference. Okay, so... Is that the first one? Yes. Okay, so I'm gonna have to go far to the right. Then I'm gonna have to crouch to the left. And then go far to the right again. And then crouch right down the center. Okay. okay so go through the right. Crouch my way through the left. Go through the far right and crouch my way right down the center. Oh, I made it. You are now in the Arcadia control grid. Every critical system of the city runs through these servers. I would gladly shut this whole room off if I knew how to. Me too. But since we do not know how to do that, we should use it to our advantage and find Trevor. Okay. Well, this looks no! like an access point. I can't believe this machine is also a hexagon level. Oh, thank God. There's one of those access level devices in here. How does this thing work now? Why do they make this process so damn complex? And why does this machine provide access to all levels? I only need hexagon. Okay, so yellow goes like that, maybe? What? Hold up. So you go there, 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 up to there, but how do you go from there to there? Where does that light blue cable come from? Are those maybe? Did that not do it? Hello? Looks like I don't have all the info to figure this thing out yet. Okay. Okay, so I can undo things. Okay, so obviously light that one up because that's hexagon. Looks or do like I, I have, have to start over to here maybe? Yet. So am I going from here to the card or am I going from the card to the thing? Or does that even matter? I'll start over here. So we're going into this. And then... Is it over to this? To that? No. This to that? down to here. I mean, how is that not right? Okay, let's think about this. Oh! No, that doesn't... <laughs> Am I trying to follow the line of the... What am I even doing? Am I supposed to do them in a specific order? Am I just supposed to get the right pattern overall? Hold up. Looks like I don't have all the info to figure this thing out yet. So if you follow that, that's a line, that's a line, that's a line, line. And that makes a hexagon, but there's still one left over. Several days later. 
Okay, there's got to be like a clue or something somewhere. Um. Gosh, I don't know. Oh, there's a door here. Oh, hello. A really simple wiring. That's all. I only have to keep track of the yellow cable. I'll take a picture of it just in case. Oh, nice. Okay, that helps. That helps a lot. Okay. There we go. Okay, so that's going to be backwards. This comes through here and goes here. So that's there. So now we go across to here. And then down here. And then it goes through here. Which is there. Then it jumps over here. Goes up. And then up to there. Which is here and then down. Access level upgraded. New level. Hexagon. Hey hey. Okay. Arcadia control grid. Help me find my good friend, Trevor Clarence Hills. AKA Arcadia's public enemy number one. AKA 10392. 372 cameras? Really? Oh, looks like this is gonna take a while, number six. Do you have time now to explain that really bold move you were talking about? Yes. Once you locate Trevor, get him to. You know where old Arcadia is, right? The abandoned prototype town? Why do you want me to bring Trevor there? Because that is where Arpad Kobach's Diziorama workshop is. And since we know they stole his technology for the jingle, we need to use it to get it out of Trevor's head. <laughs> what? Removing the jingle? Are you crazy? Th th that plan is like a hundred to one shot to put it mildly. We barely know anything about the jingle. That is why you need to get inside realignment and find as much information as you can. But only after you bring... Ugh, number four, I told you to slow down, damn it. S stop the car and act casual when the cop comes. Kovacs, please, trust me. Bring Trevor to old Arcadia. We're counting on you. There he is. Okay. Ugh, finally. No, 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 Trevor, don't do it. Don't sign that. Comms were locked, so the only way I found to communicate with him was to play an audio file from my phone. And guess what song was the first one in my <laughs> recently played files? Andrew? Kovacs? Is that you? Okay, and... How do I get a brand new start? Got it. Although I don't think I'm going to be able to keep doing this using only verses of that stupid song. Open says me. Okay. Oh gosh, it's one of these things. Oh no, it's just a timing thing. Attention, subject spotted. Send what? drones to the core courtyard. What? Oh. Attention. Subject spotted. Send drones to the core courtyard. Oh. I'll wait for that one to come on. Attention. No. Nope. Subject spotted. Send drones to the core courtyard. My timing oh. is off. Okay. Ten three ninety two has been detected. Sending drone to the courtyard. Oh. oh boy. Okay. So I'll wait for it to come on, then I'll wait for it to turn off, and then I'll just gun it. I guess.
I'm not gonna be fast enough. Attention, subject yep. spotted. Let's count this out then. One thousand one, one thousand two, one thousand three, one thousand four, one thousand five, one thousand six, one thousand one, one thousand two, one thousand three, one thousand four, one thousand five, one thousand six, one thousand seven, one thousand one, one thousand two, one thousand three, one thousand four, one thousand five, one thousand six. Thank you very much. Here we go. There's a vent right there. I wonder if I can go up it. Cadia Core. The beating heart of the city of tomorrow. Or heard of this place. I'm assuming that this is the correct way to go. Well, you know what happens when you assume. You make an ass out of you and me. Okay. I'm heading back to my penthouse now, Chief. Make sure everything's ready for tomorrow. Got it? I will see to it personally, Miss Walton. Just give Trevor some time. He'll come to reason. I do not have much faith in that, but we'll see. Oh, and Chief, you don't need to overdo your thing, you know, all the time. Just settle back a little bit, okay? No can do. That's the way I work, Miss Walton. Whatever. See you tomorrow night. Hmm. Well... See, I... I have a feeling that Breakout isn't telling Trevor and Angela everything. But also, I don't like Walton Media. So, I don't really know who the big baddie is. But something just doesn't, doesn't sit right with me about Breakout. Like, there's something going on there. Um, like, who, who is number six? Why is he using the same voice modulator that Angela originally used on Trevor? To hide Correct. her identity. If you can hear me, this place is full of drones. You better do something. Oh boy, this is interesting. Oh. Okay, let's turn that on. That goes over here. Turn that on. Okay. Then it goes into the vent, and this continues along that way. And what door is that? Through here, I guess? No. That's interesting. How do I... Oh! Okay, switch over to that one. Just gotta wait for it to fly around again. The day the running started, 11-11-23. 
smash the mustache for Dan. Okay, there is a guy in this room. Do I have to get them all? I'm just I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to get them all. And he left. Good night. And jump over to that one. Stun him. And jump over to that one. Stun him. Jump over to that one. Stun him. Is that it? We good? Okay. Let's try to go for it. Oh. Oh. Looks like the drones are on our side now. Cool. Only in this area. So don't get used to it. Okay, I'm just saying, if I was if this was me in real life, I would go up the stairs. I would not climb up this stupid box. Like what are you doing, Trevor? Oh, 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 oh. Uh is there how do I get over there? Yeah, I'm just gonna run for it. Hope for the best. Why is this door beeping so loud? Stop beeping, damn it! Hexagon, drone to core hall 40B. Drone to core hall 40B! Drone to 40B! What's going on? The drones are off? No! Target. Okay. Oh, crap. Okay, so there's gonna be a drone through there, through that gap. Jump over. I have to wait for it to go over there. Jump over to him. So it looks like I've gotta time the door for when he'll be in this window. Or well, where this'll be lined up with him in the window. So that's interesting. Why is this door beeping so loud? Come on. Stop beeping, damn it! There we go. Come on. Come on, dude, crouch. You can crouch. You have the ability to crouch. What are you doing? Okay. Oh, well, I'm outside again. So that's progress, I oh, guess. Oh, look at that! Looks like I got a drone on me. Yeah! <laughs> hey! Very nice. Why isn't Angela saying anything? Oh, because she still can't verbally communicate with them. amazing! <laughs> There's the subject. Right no, why? I stopped before he. Your guns. I'm warning you. These drones now do my bidding. So you, you, you better leave, or, or, I won't be responsible for the harm these little killing machines might cause you. Subject ten three ninety two. You're giving me way too much trouble for a pathetic whim. I still wonder how you managed to get the required rank to control and manipulate Arcadia's automated personnel. But it doesn't matter anymore. I'll escort you back to your cell. As soon as I have you rendered unconscious. Open the trap door. Kovacs, if you can hear me, please do something. Kovacs. Who is Kovacs? Ah! So that was Miss Solano's doing. Yes, but... She obviously knew it wasn't that far to the ground. That's why she opened the hatch. Uh, yeah, yeah, of course, of course. I mean, I, I, have, <laughs> I had everything under control. What? He said Kovacs do something, and I did the first thing that came into my mind. <laughs> Dude, grab the... Gra grab it! Trevor! Trevor! Grab it! Don't move! Don't move or I'll shoot you, I swear to God! I know when someone has what it takes to pull the trigger just by looking in their eyes. And you don't have the guts, 10392. Damn it! Just 
Leave me alone. Trevor, you... Hexagon. You idiot. There's a freaking stun gun. Hexagon. Do you copy? All you had to do was pull the trigger. I'm just glad he didn't turn around and try to try to grab it. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do at all. Oh, oh well. Hopefully that doesn't come back to bite me. I just got lucky the first time. Oh crap. Should have jumped instead of just dropping. Come on, Trevor. You got this. Trevor. Miserable wretch. So you can brainwash me? No thanks. And jump. You won't make it to the other side. 10392. There is no escape. You know what? Even my grandpa could jump that. What? Halfway through my jump. I suddenly realized how rickety the ladder was, but it was too late to do anything about it. Ah! Oh, no, no! Ah! I fell about nine feet, and I landed in a puddle of some sort of thick liquid. It smelled awful, but it helped cushion the blow. You think you made it, 10392? Mm. I don't Yeah, yeah, I hear you. Keep barking, you idiot! And Trevor's gonna have back problems for life. What do I do now? Where do I go? What on earth? Huh, is that old Arcadia? To Arcadia. Or, at least welcome to the land where the city of tomorrow is being built. The Arcadia project is moving forward spectacularly fast, and we hope to have it finished for summer of 1961. Let's take a quick view of some of the amazing perks that Arcadia has to offer. First of all, our suburbs. Modern housing with the latest technology included, service droids, voice-operated devices, and everything a modern American family oh, needs. In the 60s? And with our road system that will communicate easily with the downtown area, you won't have to worry about traffic anymore. Get to work either by monorail, 
or an electric car. And what about leisure? If you want to enjoy a good movie, there is a spectacular drive-in theater with an immersive new system called Visiorama. But that's not all. We have a special surprise for our audience, and here is our good friend Arpad Kovacs to explain it to us. Hello, Mr. Walton. Hello, kids. I am here to tell you we are building a new TV studio right here in Arcadia. So from now on, I will be recording Architects of Tomorrow from my workshop right here. Isn't that amazing? So, Arcadia already has its first neighbor. What are you waiting for? Call and make your reservation so you can be one of the lucky ones to be selected. Ask for housing in Arcadia now and be welcome to... A wonderful tomorrow to live in. All right, well, that's where we're going to have to call it for today. Man, this is getting pretty crazy. Lots of uh, layers, like like an onion or an ogre or a parfait. All right, well, if you liked what you saw, drop a like down below. Please leave a comment. Let me know your theory on what the crap is going on here. Please subscribe to catch the next episode of American Arcadia. Thanks for watching.